Noon, a terrifying experience. Skydivers flying over Lake Wales fell thousands of feet to the pavement. Emergency crews tell us that they found three of those skydivers after they got off course and had to make those hard landings. Incredibly, they are all okay. 10 Tampa Bay reporter and Andrea Lyons spoke to one man who was there just moments after they hit the ground. David Clemens, a man you're about to meet, heard a scream, came outside, knew something was wrong, came down here to scenic highway and took a picture of this. Oh, I could see the chute. It was all tangled up and she, her helmet was off and yeah, she took a very hard hit and she will never forget this jump. Just as crosswalk lights started flashing and school was about to break out for the day. This was the first in my neighborhood. <laughs> 14 people jumped from a plane at more than 14,000 feet. We see them skydive all the time. Three of them though, practically falling at David Clemens feet, just a block from where he was relaxing on his front porch. Crews found the jumpers between Seminole Avenue and Wiltshire Avenue in Lake Wales. With two of their chutes deployed, another was partially tangled. So I just took some pictures. I didn't see anybody else taking pictures. Officers tell us while well, one avoided injuries altogether, the other two, including this woman, were seriously hurt. Uh, normally, I don't take pictures of people in injuries, yeah. but it was a newsworthy event. Although are expected to jump another day. Don't stop. I know you'll recover and please, please realize how many people prayed for you while you were laying there. In Lake Wales, Andrea Lyon, 10 Tampa Bay. Incredible. And although a few other skydivers did land a little bit off course, they landed in nearby pastures. Thankfully, they are okay. There were no other injuries that were reported. Unbelievable.